Are you looking to integrate a new payment gateway with your form? Let me show you how to utilize sandbox mode to test it to make sure it works perfectly. Hey Jotformers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly and as you can see, I am currently in the features landing page of sandbox mode. So like I mentioned, if you're wanting to add a new payment gateway to your form, it's really, really smart to put it in sandbox mode just to test it out to make sure everything works seamlessly for your user. So let's walk through a couple of different ways. Now, again, if you have any questions about utilizing sandbox mode, make sure you check out this features landing page because there's gonna be a lot more information here than what we're gonna cover in this video, but let's go ahead and jump over. All right, I am in our test form for sandbox mode. And if you would like to play with this as well in a form that's not your own, you can always utilize this form as well. And as we can see, it is a pizza order form. So if I scroll scroll down, I can see our product list here, basically. And if I click on it, I can see that it is going to be through Stripe. Now, keep in mind that if you're wanting to do sandbox mode with PayPal, we have another video for that because you're going to need to go to the developer side of PayPal to get API keys and just some special things for that. But if you're going to be utilizing Stripe, it is really, really simple. So as you can see, I'm already connected through Stripe and the mode that we're in right now is live mode. So if we want to put it in sandbox mode or test mode, all we have to do is click on this drop down and change it over to test. Now, as you can see, since I changed over from live to test mode, it has logged me out of my account. So let me go ahead and log back in and we can give this a test. All right, we are logged back in, we are in test mode. And if we look at the form itself, it says right here, sandbox mode is enabled for this payment. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose to continue. We are good to go. Now, another thing that you can do with sandbox mode is you can add collaborators. So up at the very top, we have right here, add collaborator. So if you want someone else on your team or one of your coworkers to give this a test with you, you can add collaborators to your form. So if we click right here, we can copy this link. Perfect, we can send it to them and now they can collaborate on this format with us. All right, I'm going to head to the top right-hand corner. Let's go ahead and preview this form and I'm going to fill it out really quick. Then we're going to choose, let's say the pizza pepperoni for $13. Now in order to utilize the sandbox mode for Stripe, Stripe provides us with card information to utilize with this for a test. So we don't have to use our own cards. So we would enter that in here and verify that everything works perfectly. But it's as simple as that. If you have any other questions about utilizing sandbox mode to test your new payment integration, let us know down below in the comments. And don't forget to check out that features landing page to answer even more of your questions. If you like this video and you got some value, hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get a notification every time we put out a new video. I'll see you next time.